Yo, 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 everybody. My name is Ace Games, and we are in the nether in the attack of the B team, in which the B team attacks. But I wanted to get some cobalt for our next tool. So let me just see if my hammer is capable of breaking this stuff. Because we went to the nether in like episode 3 or 4, and we couldn't just break it with a normal pickaxe. By the way, I enchanted my pickaxe, but I got like fortune and unbreaking and... Um, efficiency 4, I think, at level 30, which is pretty good. Um, so yeah, I just want to see if this cobalt will break, because I would like to make a, um, lumber axe with some cobalt on it. Five minutes later, we're still here breaking this stupid cobalt, but I hope it'll be worth it. We better get this. If we don't, I'm gonna be a sad little boy. I am now trying to break it with my pickaxe because I don't think the hammer is capable of doing anything. Seriously. We're gonna have to make like a, a pickaxe that is so much haste that it's just ridiculous. You know what would be good if we used a jeweled apple on this stuff? Cause then that would be easy. All right, I'll come back for you later with a jeweled apple. We're just gonna make this thing out of bronze. Bronze. Here's our portal. I'm thinking of doing another hub. Probably not though because of the enhanced portals mod. Um, so let's just go in here. Why do I have two luggages in here? All right, whatever. And we've got some progress on the house. So today in this episode, we are going to furnish our beautiful house. Our sexy little cutie pie house. Um, the smooth lighting is all whacked up and freak but i'm all right with it um oh crap sleep do a sleep job um but i just want to make a quick lumber axe and i can't be morphed to do so or to do anything and i mean to sleep so yeah let me show you something after i do a sleep job hello i did the storage system ba boom check check it out all right what do you want what do you want from for your life? You want a power two bow? Okay, just grab it. You want um some cobblestone? All right, just grab uh seven of them. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you don't want those saplings in your inventory? Throw them in there. They gone. You want to see where they go? They go in here. That's where they go. So this is the page by page storage system from Project Red that I have been wanting forever and ever. Did I get those things? Yeah, I got the power two bow and cobblestone. Yeah. So check it out. Check it out. We go down here. I'm gonna make like a little service hatch sooner or later. Um, wrong block. Let's uh, let's check it out as a bat because they're one high and they can fly basically how you set it up let me show let me show too um let me just make sure we're not in cheat mode because it does that every time yeah we're in SP. it does it every time you update and it's very annoying and you feel like a cheater but i'm not a cheater so that you connect them you connect the orange pipe which is called a routed request pipe very very easy to make let me show you let me show Routed, nope, routed, routed request pipe. This is basically all the things you're going to need. You want a, one routed request pipe. That is redstone, diamonds, and this routed junction pipe, which is just a glass pane diamonds and these infused silicon, which you get from smelting um, red silicon compound, which is um, a silicon with redstone around it. A silicon is a diamond saw against a silicon buell and a silicon buell is sandy coal compound which sandy coal compound is a block of coal with sand around it got it good and then what you're going to want to need is you want a bunch of routed interface pipes which is just redstone and gold nuggets around this thing which is with the silicon and such then you want routed junction pipes as well which you get 16 of from just this bit and that's basically all you need for now. And then you get your chest with the hopper 
and you connect that into a routed interface pipe and then the uh, routed request pipe is just connected with these item transport pipes which are also very easy let me show you well actually they're just glass panes and stone and you get like 16 of them for every craft so uh, whoops no no minions go away and basically what you want to do then is connect this all with these item transport pipes and these are all my chests um, that hold all the stuff so that's pretty much everything and you connect them like this you take the transport pipes and every chest has to have this purple one on it and on these purple ones you need these item responders chips and item broadcaster trip trip chips not trips so item responder um an item responder chip is just this this uh basic routing chip type thingy with his gold nuggets and a redstone. You guys can figure this out for yourselves. You know how to do the crafting bit. But every single one of these has to have a item responder and an item broadcaster. So like you see here, every single one has to have those two in them. And basically, you just put those all up next to chests. And then you connect them with these item transport pipes. And, and then, when you go up here... You'll need a couple more chips. You need, um, in this one, you need this item extractor chip, which will allow you to do all this. So that's basically the gist of it. You can Google it if, if you don't find my explanation um, good, I guess, if you don't find it clear enough. But that's basically it, and it, it's really good. It's the best storage system that you could ever get. Like, item frames, get out of here. So first thing I'm going to do, and I'm going to make this paper tough rod. Um, I found out that you actually need more than one. So if I just put one in there, you can't get it. You need, um, let me show you. You need, you need three paper to make the thing. So that was my fault in, whoops, I kicked my desk. That was my fault in the last episode. Why, why isn't it working now? Okay, give. You get a paper tough rod, and then pretty much the other thing well that can uh, that can go in here for now we're making this lumber axe just so you know and then what did I make the uh, what did I make this out of I think what what can we make the um, the other bit out of let's make let's make the actual thing let's make the actual uh, let's make the broad let's make the axe head out of some browns um, so let me, give me this and do I have, there, go in there. And this is more of an accurate representation of Tinker's Construct. So if we put that in there, just put, can you not use that? No? All right, let's use a uh, smooth stone. Smooth stone. Um, you need eight of something. So let me go back over here and get some smooth stone. And the smooth stone has been had. And you want to go back over here, go to your part builder, and get their thing. And then you just need eight of these, and you'll get the thing now. So that was that was my fault in the last episode. So put that in there, and get your molten aluminum brass at the bottom, and pour that over it. Put it down on me. So get that, and then get that. And do I have my backpack? No, I think it's in the house. So, um, pretty much we want to put this down and we'll just make this out of bronze as well. And that's not so bad. Bronze was pretty good for our, for our hammer. And ba-boom, make a bronze badass head or badass, broad axe, not badass. Um, so that's going to take forever, just like everything else. Um you need this cast so we don't need this really um i'm gonna get a couple lockers down here so that we can have extreme storage space and you got this now so put that in your tool forge if i do say so myself put that there and we have this thingy so let's make this out of bronze as well um just because we can or can we do that out of iron Maybe. Do I have iron? Yeah, we do, but we only have a little bit. Um, yeah, bronze will work. There we go. Get the bronze. 
and you can put that in there as well. We're doing a lumber axe, just so you know, get a lumber axe job. Um, and we can do this bit out of, let's see if tin will be enough. Get made cast. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And what can we do for this? Let's do tin, like I was saying. Or, yeah, tin. There we go. And, do you not, I don't think tin does anything. So, let's, uh, let's see if iron will be enough. Get ironed. Yeah, it's not enough. Let's go get some more iron. And that should harden just a bit. And now we have that. And let's go ahead and make our lumber axe. Um, so yeah, we got that. And now, let's go get some modifiers. I tell you, man, these slimes are annoying. I'm gonna get some different water in here. Because those, they spawn next to this all the time. And they are super hostile and kind of difficult to kill. Because there's just so freaking many of them. I'm thinking of the, uh, the tinkers, or the, uh, the Tropicraft water from the, um, like the, uh, what do you call what do you call, man? And I want some mossy cobblestone so we can get some auto repair on this thing. So mossy. All right, that's that should be in our um, in our other area. So what I want is some redstone. So let's get redstone. That should be plenty. Um, let's just smith that. Oh no, I want all of them. So all. And then we want probably no. What the heck? Um. I want probably five redstone blocks and submit that and let's just throw away some stuff while we're here um dirt don't need that don't need a bow i can't wait to make a uh, bow with this thing so that'll be fun um we got some of that so that should be enough to throw away for now let me get a little snack we need to get some meat house in this place because i ain't no little bitch eating bread all the time. I need some meat in my bones. Um, get out here. And let's morph again. Come on, get morphed. And we'll fly. Oh yeah, I need some mossy as well. So, mossy cobblestone. Let's just get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 on that. And I want some lapis la pussy. La pussy? No, not la, la pussy. No. What did I, what am I saying? Oh, there's lapis. So, actually we don't need luck on this, huh? We just need, let's see, what can we, what else can we put on this? Um, I might put silk touch on it. How do you get, there's something that you need called silky cloth to get silk touch. Silky, so how make? Um, just string around a, oh, that's, that's totally easy. Let's get that. Well, first of all, let's make the, let's make this thing, the moss, so it's auto repair, and we never have to repair it in our lives, and let's make the, um, this thing, or, uh, I need gold nugget, huh, um, let's just craft that in here, gold nugget, nugget, gold nugget, um, so that gives me a silky cloth, and that's all you really need to make it silk touch, so we can have a nice little silk touch deal right here. I don't really know if we need silk touch, but we're gonna get it anyway. Um, oh, and diamond. Let's get some diamonds. No, I don't have any diamonds. And so now, let's get in Tool Forge. And let's put this thing up here. And we want the ball of moss, first of all. And then let's put the, uh, well, let's put redstone on it first. Because that's haste. That's the most important thing. And you get all the things. And I'm not really sure who I'm going to shout out in this episode yet. Um, so that's just a couple more reinforcement things. And now, let's... Oh, can we get more? Oh, we can. We can get way more. Let's uh, let's make this all into, into blocks. Because that will be much easier. Um, so we get six blocks out of that. And... Get all the redstone, my friend. And that's almost there. I think that's get that gets nine every time, so it's much faster. Um, is that all we can do? 
Yep, that's all. So that should be fast off the charts. And next thing I want to do after this is going to be um, a, uh, probably a rapier or a battle axe. Um, most likely a battle axe because it's just so cool. Oh, this is the uh, enchantment I got on this anyway. Um, it's 15 C4, Fortune 3, and I'm breaking 3. Not bad. Um, so let's put a couple diamonds on this thing. And that will get the durability up. And it makes it look really cool. And what else, what does quartz do, by the way? Um, is that all the modifiers we have? Um, yeah, I think so. So that's a pretty good mining speed. Let's go try this thing out on a tree. So this is the functionality of this thing. You chop bottom block. Yeah, look how fast that is. And the whole thing comes flying down to your to your feet and it kneels before you because you're such a badass with this lumber axe and let's let's give a shout out um i'm gonna think of who to shout out right now um let's just do lamp because he's helped me he's helped me do the fountain and he's helped me um he's helped me just grow as a channel. He's a really cool guy. He's just started doing some, uh, oh, is that not name? Get named. Foo. Um, he's just helped me grow as a channel. He's given me a shout out, obviously. Uh, no, he hasn't. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, link to him. Link to, link to his channel will be in the description. Can I not name you? Come on, baby. Get named. Um, Baby, get named. Um, can I... Why isn't it naming? That's strange. Um... Well, I guess we'll just name it an anvil. Let's go name it in an anvil. That shouldn't take too much, too many levels. Um, so yeah, that's weird that it wasn't naming. But yeah, shout out to iLampX Gaming. He's just started doing videos. He's doing a let's build on the Fantasia server. Birds will not shut up ever. So, let's just do it in the anvil, I guess. I, and it's only seven levels, that's convenient though. I lamp X gaming, I think the X is actually, um, is actually little X. So yeah, that, that's our new tool. That's the tool for today. And, um, next shout out will probably be a gun because I wanna, I wanna start just getting some guns. And I'm thinking that I'm gonna do an armory. Um, I just love how awesome that is. That's the coolest thing ever. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna do an armory that's gonna look really cool. So I'm gonna build that in creative, um, in a creative test world. And we'll get to that um, later. Do I have any wool? No, I just have bat wool. Um, give me my shears then. So we'll go shear some wools. Shear some wools? No. Shear some, uh, and let me get the bookshelves as well because we're gonna do our enchanting area today. Um, I, I've got this really cool design for an awesome enchanting, um, little dealio. So, let's go shoot some, some little guys over here. And this is my sheep farm, just so you know. Um, oh, you have a mohawk, bro. I kind of want to kill you. Oh, it's not a mohawk, it's like a mammoth. Oh yeah, it's a, it's a huge walrus. Oh my god, he's, he's dying right now. Get dead. Yeah, cute walrus, like a boss. Give me a cute walrus and don't make me a sheep. I am no sheep. Give me bat. These couches are actually pretty difficult to make. I thought they were much easier, but um, we'll just have to expand our sheep farm sooner or later. So um, that that's going to happen. That will happen. Trust me. So what we want to do here, one, two, three and quattro. Um, I don't know why the lighting's all weird like that, but yeah, that's our couch right there, and we'll do the whole, we'll just make a separate, um, video for interior design, but, um, I want to do the enchanting area. I've already, like, laid out what I want. Um, let's do a sleep job. Take a little nap. So, let's, um, let's get a torch in here. Do I have any torches? Oh, what's that? <gasps> trophy! Take that in the face, B double O. I got a trophy. Ha! Sheep trophy. That's it's the joke. Um, let me turn up my sound. What do you do? Yeah, B double O has been trying to get a trophy forever now, and 
I'm so excited I got one before him. Let's uh, let's put him right here so we don't forget him, and we can just put him in our kitchen. Um, oh my God, that's awesome. Take that in the face, B Dubs. The Dubs. Um, <laughs> that's so funny. You you guys have to go and subscribe to B Double O. He's hilarious. So let's um, let's get like four different varieties of or five different varieties of bookshelves. Um, let's get um, let's get like this type. Necromancer's Novice's bookshelf. Um, let's get some of these. Um, let's get let's get these ones. And did I already get these? No, I didn't. Um, Porter's bookshelf. Um, yeah, and that's and one more. Let's do this. Um, just because. So let's uh, make all this relevant. I guess that's the saying. Um, oh, I can't move my chisel, so get out the way and get in my inventory. Um, let's make right there. Um, we're just gonna randomize this book, this, um, this whole dealio, so let's put this up there, and let's, uh, make sure to use the other ones as well, so I hope that these, uh, provide enchantment. I hope they do. No, I already used that one, didn't I? Give. Wow, that takes forever. What the heck, man? Why is that taking forever with an axe? That's strange. Um, but let's uh, let's use this one. Um, that's got some weird things in it, I guess. Let's use that. And up here, let's um make this one. Let's make that that one. Um, this is so interesting that we can just make the bookshelves all different. No. Alright, whatever. Um, let's do that a couple times around. No, let's do, let's do this one that. Um, let's make this, that one. And we can, like, hide glowstone under here, I just realized. So, um, do I have any glowstone? Let me grab some glowstone. And we can, because bookshelves are transparent blocks, so we can, uh, nope, wrong thing. Um, glow, glow to the stone. Um, let's just get five of them. And that's gonna shoot out in a nice shower of awesome storage systems. Um, let's get glowstone and put that, um, about right, right in there. Right about there, so. And then we can make this thingy. Oh. Oh, the, these aren't transparent? What the heck, man? Alright, so I guess pickaxes break that. Alright, that makes no sense at all, but let's roll with it. Um, Did I really just do that? Get me out of here! And let's just make this, um, this one last bookshelf. Like that. I don't really care if it's the same thing. Um, let's make that and make that one. And then we just have these last three or four, I mean, actually five. All right, deal with it. Um, let's make that one, that one, that one, and that one. So, yeah, look at that nice little kind of hoarders looking enchantment area and do i have any tools that aren't enchanted no i do not but it gets to level 30 just trust me let me see can i look at it no um but yeah it gets you to level 30 i've already tested it out in a creative world and yeah that's nice so one more thing i want to do while we're here um let me get some obsidian i believe how do you make it um so it's called ceiling light Ceiling light, and how do you make obsidian, smooth stone, and glowstone? So let me get all those things. I have glowstone, so I just need obsidian. No, I don't have that. Um, obsidian, stone. Yeah, I got some stone. I just need, I just need one of them. And give me that, and we'll go ahead and grab some uh, the obsidian from the outside and bring it in here. Um, I'm gonna move all my 
items off camera because you guys clearly don't want to watch that. Um, so where is my obsidian? I know I have a ton of it somewhere. Hey, I think next episode we're going to go into the uh, Tropicraft realm. Whelm? We're going to go in the Tropicraft realm? No, realm. Um, that's, you sit in this chair at sunset and you drink a pina colada and you get transported into, like, this beautiful, beautiful, like, Tropicraft realm. And it's fun and games. Holy crap, holy crap, I'm, I'm freaking dying. What's attacking? Oh my god, these things are good. These things hurt. Oh, and I was standing in a cactus as well, so. Get dead. Get dead. That was a weird voice crack. Um... So let me go in here and get a little ceiling lamp action. These are really cheap and they provide a good amount of light. So I'm going to do it directly above the uh, enchanting table. So that would be right right there. And that's our little ceiling lamp. Um, I'm going to paint these walls some like dark purple color. And this will be like our little hangout area. Like a TV and like our workshop i guess um it'll be like our little man cave so that's gonna be cool i'm gonna paint those off camera maybe i'll do a little interior design um <clears throat> sorry that was a weird voice thing but i hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of the attack of the b team in which the b team attacks i don't know what's the deal with this little lighting bit let me uh turn off smooth lighting nope all the way off yeah it looks normal now but um everything else looks crappy so we're gonna do the kitchen and we're gonna visit the little chopcraft realm and get the water from there because that water is really pretty too and it doesn't spawn freaking m murder slimes like that crappy water does i'm so excited i'm gonna show this i'm gonna tweet this to b double o and he is gonna hate me for it but it's all right he's you just have to watch his episode and see how mad he gets when he doesn't get his trophies. <clears throat> Stop being weird voice. Yeah. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. And I'll see you.